Good morning, everybody. You say good morning. <laughs> Silly you. Yeah, good morning. So I am making myself a big cup of coffee. I am tired, you guys. Hold on, let me sit you down and I'll talk to you. I'll make my coffee. Um, so, so uh, it is eight o'clock. We've been up for probably about 20 minutes. We just came downstairs, but we like to relax in the bed for a little bit. is in the shower he's got some chores to do today he's working on a truck for a friend I have chores to do today gotta get this house whipped into shape because it is a Thursday and we have Pax's birthday party here on Sunday and we have some other stuff going on this weekend it is the 4th of July today um, so we are busy busy and so I thought that I would start this vlog off by doing my daily stuff cleaning and all that kind of stuff we'll see what we get into later if it warms up we might go to the lake if we can get all of our stuff done uh, I'm not really sure our neighborhood has like a a, um, a like a party thing going on today so I'm not really sure what we're gonna do but um, I do know one thing for sure, we've got some yard work to do, we have house work to do. Yeah, and so we're going to have to get that stuff done before we can go have fun. But I wanted to, yeah, start off this vlog and say good morning and say hi and tell you what's going on today. So if you are not subscribed before you continue watching, pause this video and subscribe, hit that notification bell and give this video a thumbs up. It helps me out a lot. and. We are growing steadily and I want to keep that momentum so make sure that you tell your friends about my YouTube channel if you enjoy it. Um, so let's get to a thousand subscribers and I'm going to do a giveaway. So um, without further ado, let's go ahead and jump into it. I'll see you guys in a little bit. I'm going to drink my coffee. Okay guys, so I am just starting off by taking our trash. Um, this is usually my husband's job, but it was full and I knew it needed to be taken out, so I just went ahead and did it so I didn't have to worry about him or going and bothering him while he's doing his chores, so I just took care of it. But um, I wanted to say that uh, this video kind of turned into just a clean with me, so hopefully this gives you some motivation to get some stuff done in your house. This is basically how I spent my 4th of July, it was just cleaning. So um, I am just taking out the trash and then I'm doing some pickup throughout the entire house and then I'm going to be deep cleaning some areas. So hopefully you guys enjoy that. But a little tip that I didn't show in this video but I do all the time is after I put my trash bag, a clean trash bag in, I like to drop some essential oils down in there just to keep it smelling nice. And then um, I am moving on. I had these boxes. I usually don't empty the box right when we open them of diapers and wipes, but it was close to being empty. So I thought that I would just go ahead and pull that stuff out and take this out into the garage so my husband can take it to the dump. And Pax was wanting to see exactly what I was doing. So he was right in the way, but. Um, moving on into my living room. You guys, I am having the worst time with this rug I don't know what it is but it slides so much do you guys have a recommendation um, any really good um, mat little things that go under the the rugs um, to help them sliding I don't have one but if you guys know of a good one definitely let me know because I need something it's ridiculous how much this thing slides but a, I'm going to go ahead and run the vacuum uh, throughout my entire downstairs through the hardwood so let's go ahead and do that and then we will probably mop after.
Okay, so now that I have the downstairs nice and vacuumed, I am just going to run the mop across the floor all downstairs. I am currently using a Swiffer, as you can see, but I am in the market for a new mop. So let me know down below what your favorite mop is and what you guys use because I am on the hunt and I wanna have something that I know that I'm gonna love and I'm gonna use a lot. The Swiffer just isn't cutting it for me. I swear I can use it like, three times in one day and I still feel like my floors aren't clean. So let me know, let me know down below what you guys suggest. But um, on a different note, I get a lot of questions about this table and I actually redid this table about a year and a half ago. I did not film it. I think I filmed um, some clips, but I don't know if I ended up posting it or not, but I absolutely love the way it turned out. I sanded it down, chalk painted the bottom, and stained the top, and I'm just in love with it. I think it's so pretty and so farmhouse, and it makes me so, so happy. But anyway, um, moving on, we are just running the mop through our dining room, kitchen area, and I wanted to remind you guys to, if you have not liked this video or subscribed to my channel, then stop what you're doing and pause this video and go subscribe and give this video a thumbs up. It means so much to me. I love this community that we are developing and I want to get to know you guys. So let me know down below where you are from um, and tell me one um, fun fact about where you're from, okay? So yeah, go ahead and stop what you're doing right now and do that for me. Okay, so now I'm just giving all of my appliances a good wipe down. We do have stainless steel and little tiny fingerprints get all over it with this little boy running around my house like a madman. So I usually do this at least once a day, sometimes more if it needs it, but I'm just gonna give everything a good wipe down really quick and get it looking all nice again. And I am using the Method All Purpose Cleaner in the Honeycrisp Apple. This is my favorite scent. And Isn't this a perfect picture of mom life? Me cleaning the little fingerprints off of there and he's coming right up to it, making more as I'm cleaning it. I want to be frustrated with him, but he is just so darn cute and I can't. Okay, so this is probably the number one thing that I neglect to do in my house because it's so time consuming, so tedious, and I hate it. But there was definitely some spots on our walls that needed to be cleaned, so I am just getting down there and I'm getting to it. This is his designated play area, as you can see. So little fingerprints and dirty hands and all of that fun stuff gets all over the walls. So I am just giving those areas a good wipe down and then I'm also gonna wipe down the door here it leads out to our garage and so that sometimes gets um, dirty as well with my husband working on vehicles and doing everything else that he does but let's go ahead and wipe down our baseboards and our walls and again i am using the method all-purpose cleaner in the honeycrisp apple i use this stuff all over my house you guys literally for everything so i am using that it is safe on walls it doesn't bring anything off of it um, it doesn't take any of the color or anything off that I have noticed, so I love it, and it does everything, and it's non-toxic. So I get this from Grove, and as always, if you guys are looking for Grove or if you're interested in it, I do have a link down below that you can go check it out. It is where I get all my cleaning products, and I'm obsessed. Moving right along into my favorite area to clean. Not 
This is our master bedroom. It is a catch-all. Everything always ends up in here. I don't know why, but it does. But I am go ahead and starting off by dusting our um, all of our dressers and nightstands and this mirror, wiping it down and all of that good stuff. So I'm gonna start off by doing that. Also, I just thought I would throw this in there. Um, we got black dressers and bed and all of that bed frame, and I absolutely regret that because it collects dust and you can see every little thing on it. So next time, um, we're definitely gonna get white or a different color because black is, it. everything shows up on it and it drives me nuts. I've now made my way into our master bath and as you can see the counters are a mess so I am just starting by putting away my blow dryer, straightener, steamer, my makeup bag and then I'm going to wipe down everything and clean the mirrors and all of that fun stuff. mamas are too short to clean their mirrors on the ground so they have to get up on the counters. Raising my hand. So now I'm just going to clean, um, empty the trash can and pick up what fell out. I got this trash can from the Dollar Tree if you're wondering and then I'm just going to give the toilet a good cleaning. Um, nobody enjoys doing this but it's gotta be done, so let's go ahead and just get it over with.
Last thing I want to do in my bathroom is give it a good vacuuming and a good mopping. So I'm going to pick up my rugs and we're going to get it done. you guys but I always neglect to put my kids clothes away they usually end up in a basket like this and I will just pick through them and find his clothes and so today I am actually putting them away and in his closet for the first time in forever it feels like So my dogs are crazy. I have no idea what Diesel is doing, but he did not find this basket um, to be what he wanted. So you'll see in a couple minutes, he goes back into the closet and jumps into one of those baskets and finally finds a spot that he can settle down in. But I just think that was so cute, so I had to leave it in here. Before I move on, I just wanted to give his little bookshelf and his windowsill a good wipe down. With the windows open in the summertime, sometimes some dust and stuff will come in. So I just wanted to clean that up. And now I'm moving on to the dreaded stairs. You guys have been putting this off for so long, but it's finally the day. I am giving my stairs a good vacuum and then we are going to steam clean them. And this is a process, like I'm not going to lie, but with this vacuum, um, the Dyson V8, which is a cordless vacuum, and then our new steam cleaner, it has made it so much easier and quicker to be able to steam clean and vacuum the stairs. So I will leave a link for both of these down below if you're in the market for either. Um, they are amazing. and. Um, You'll see I kind of speed through this because it did take a long time, but it definitely made a huge difference and I am loving this detachment that I can use on couches. I ended up doing my, one of my couches as well and it just is amazing and it gets so much up and I love it. So let's go ahead and tackle the stairs and the couch. forgot that I did change over the laundry in between doing this and the stairs. I think I actually cleaned the guest bathroom as well, but let's go ahead and get it done.
so this is pretty much the end of the video I hope you guys enjoyed this clean with me I hope it gave you some motivation to get some cleaning done in your house if it did make sure to give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe before you leave thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video bye